Hey guys, welcome back again. If you're looking for a way to set up an auto responder or an email broadcast inside an email marketing tool, then this video will be helpful for you. Here we'll be using a tool called Get Response, and I will be setting up all those things inside that tool to automate your email marketing. But before deep diving into that, if you're new to this particular video and looking to learn more about Get Response, I highly recommend you to check out my previous video where I explained about what is Get Response and why this tool can be beneficial for a big inner email marketing guy. Now, the important part is before learning about what exactly the broadcast emails and what exactly the autoresponder, let me first explain you what this is, then after we will do this setup inside the get response. Hey guys, my name is Kirti Shwaya series on this channel. I do teach about affiliate marketing, blogging, SEO and ways to make money online. If you are new to this channel, make sure you subscribe to this channel, like this video and comment me what next video you are looking for on this channel. Let's go to the screen and just talk about how this email marketing broadcast or autoresponder will work for you. So first of all, guys, we are on the screen and there you can see I have drafted us some rough diagram just to explain you. Let imagine you are driving a traffic from different sources. So this is your traffic which is coming from different sources. Then after that traffic will be landed on your email opt-in page. If you wanted to build your uh, squeeze page or email squeeze page, make sure you watch my another video how you can design the landing or speech squeeze page for free of course. Link is in the description as well as I will provide in the i button. So now once the user will land on this page, if the user will provide his name and email ID that will goes to your email automation tool. Such as in this case, we'll be using a get response. Then after, if you wanted to send that user an automated email, let's say someone has subscribed now, right? Now you wanted to initiate some email sequences like first email should go after 24 hours, second should go after 48 hours. So this process can be automated instead of you manually sending all those stuff, right? So what you can do is simply you can set up that uh, uh, auto responder inside your email marketing tool. And that's what I'm going to teach you. Now, how this can be beneficial. Let me give you an example, guys. This is my website called bloggingos.com There I do teach you all about blogging and affiliate marketing. If somebody subscribe for this particular nine days free training series, I have done that automation in the back end. So this tool will automatically send nine emails on nine days with that free training. So if you're really interested, make sure you also subscribe. The link is in the description. Now let's talk about how exactly you can set it inside the get response. Yes, guys, there you can see on the screen. I personally use a tool called get response. This is one of the best email marketing tool for beginner. You can argue with me. There are different other tools in the market, such as MailChimp, Get Response, Active Campaign, Aweber. But all of those tools are very expensive. Yes, you can say like the MailChimp can give you a 2000 lead free for a user, but there are some issues in terms of the privacy policy that you are not able to do affiliate marketing aggressively using MailChimp. And that's why the best route, which most of the beginner, especially the affiliate marketers are using is Get Response. The biggest, another advantage with the Get Response is guys, you can get a 30 days free trial with the get response then after you can go and continue with their basic pricing plan when it comes to pricing plan you can see here guys it's a basic plan will cost you around 15 dollars and you should be able to maintain thousand leads inside of this i do on basic plan with 25,000 leads so that's why guys i'm using this person so i'm going to teach you how exactly you can set inside so link is in the description in case you wanted to go with that now let's talk about how exactly it look like so first i will come here and will log in inside my get us okay guys as as you will log in inside your uh, get response account you should be able to see whatever the email you have sent right now how what is the engagement how many new contacts been added inside your list everything this will be your dashboard on the top side you should be able to see this is a list list is something like if you will click to the list obviously you should be able to see all the list whatever have been created so you can think of list is whenever if somebody is giving me an email id i am putting that user into a particular list so let's say or oh, whoever is lead coming from my blogging os website i am putting inside the blogging os whoever is coming from different programs so in such a way i have created this multiple list mainly i'm managing this three list inside of this all my leads are been aggregated and this is the number of concept contacts inside of each and every lead uh, there are different other options which even you can look around basically it will give you 30 days uh, free trial so you can sign up right now and you can start your email marketing and you can go through different options now there is important part is guys under the menu option if you will go to menu there are three four 
main options which you will be using so number one is email marketing which in another word we call it as a newsletter or a broadcast email so if you want to send a broadcast email you have to use the option called email marketing but in case you wanted to use an autoresponder where automatically once the user will subscribe you will be sending them email automatically then you have to use this autoresponder so let's first uh, set up an autoresponder how exactly you have to set it up so first you have to click this as an autoresponder and let's say right now we have used an email list called Amazon kitchen okay so this is my list and whoever is adding into this list I wanted to send them as an autoresponder email so now what I will do is let's go to the autoresponder as you will click to the autoresponder you should be able to see whatever the autoresponder I have already said but now this is the autoresponder I have set inside this list so whoever is subscribing to this list start from zero day it will send a welcome email then if you go to this uh, first date will send day one which is an uh, uh, day one uh, a PDF then day two day three day four kind of that so now in our case what we have to do is create an autoresponder and then use no thanks basically they have a different template so we will go with the scratch you can click to here as in scratch now you can give here this name this name will be only visible to you so let's say this is a day one and uh, testing auto responder okay then after you can set here when exactly you want to send this email if you want to send instantly email as soon as user has subscribed then obviously that will be a welcome email so you can set it at welcome now you can set it here as in welcome and then after which list you wanted to set this auto response so as i said like we'll be sending this to amazon so maybe amazon kitchen and then after when you wanted to trigger this email i want to trigger this email instantly because this is an welcome email so i can set it instantly then you can come here and you can create your own email the email which you want to send instantly to the user so simply come here as in create new email you have to type here this message name this again will be your internal this will not be visible to user so let's say i have written here is in welcome uh, email but this is the subject line which will be goes to the user email box so make sure you type here welcome please confirm email id so this kind of subject line we initially send in the beginning then after this is the email id which will be visible to users so that means whatever the email will be sent by this tool will go uh, will, will be sent by this email so this is something the uh, incoming uh, user email or the, basically this is the email from which that user will receive an email if you want to change this you can simply come here and add new from email address you have to add a new email and then after that will be added inside this list let's say this time i want to send email via this particular email id now you have to go to the next as you will go to the next it will ask you to draft your email whatever the email you wanted so i'm going to the next screen and then after you can simply use this editor so that's a basic thing simple kind of editor we will start from the scratch there are different templates you can use it but i'm using it uh, scratch uh, start from the scratch as I will select it as in start, start from the scratch you should be able to see here so basically it will uh, give me a canva where I can uh, uh, do all sort of uh, I mean I can draft here a message and something so if you don't want to use it delete it if you don't want to use it delete it then after you can scroll this box you can simply write here hi welcome please verify email and then click here so basically there you can use this as in URL and simply you can say regards this is a kirti so kind of that so basically this email has been returned then you can go to the next as you will go to the next step you should be able to see here it is asking me uh, basically uh, now the email has been drafted here and as soon as any user will be added into list instantly on zero day this email will be triggered to that user simply come here save and publish as you will click to save and publish this will be set as your day zero autoresponder it will instantly drop an email to that user don't send them message basically i have already one subscriber so it's asking you wanted to send that user as an email i said like don't send it whoever is newly adding to that list automatically it will send an email so there you can see guys you can come here i can remove this and we'll come, go back to that particular list for which we set autoresponder so i set it here and you should be able to see here on day zero it will send that user this particular email thank you email then after this is the something which we just set now if you wanted to change the, the timing like no don't send it on day zero send it on day one you can set it as in day one so now what happened is on day zero this email will go on day one this email will go similarly you can add multiple lists and consistently it will start uh, automatically sending them email and this is how you can set your autoresponder but make sure if you will off this this particular sequence will not be sent so you can do the on and off from here itself 
okay so that's basic uh, toggle switch which you can use whoever is uh, received that email you can get that stat like this many people has received it let me give you an example of this particular list uh, where exactly i'm sending those emails so there you can see welcome email i sent instantly on day zero more than 1100 uh, 11,840 times i've sent 71 percent people has opened those email and 49 percent is the click rate whatever the link i'm giving inside of that so in this way guys you can see here number zero days number one day number two number three number four number five kind of that you can set multiple sequences you have to just click here create autoresponder so i hope you got an idea how to set an autoresponder now let's talk about how exactly you can broadcast email so what does it broadcast mean simple thing is let's say inside your list you have 12000 people autoresponder will send them automatic email i mean uh, that's a sequence which was already been said but what if you have some special offer which you wanted to uh, know which you wanted that user must know about that particular offer so what you can do is you can draft an email and instantly send that email that email will goes to all those users uh, you know, within a, a fraction of time okay so basically what happened is let's say uh, right now i'm selling uh, right now there is some offer going on with a hosting and i wanted to know my user like this particular hosting is offering a 70 percent discount if anybody is interested you can grab it what i will do is i will come here and draft here an email marketing so this is more of a newsletter or a broadcast i will come here I will create as in create newsletter again same editor same thing first you have to finish that particular bit so i will click here drag and drop email editor simple thing then after i will select all those subject line like uh, this is my internal message like offer and then i can say hosting offer okay so this hosting offer will be visible to user then after i can select here this particular email id like okay from this email id uh, this email should be sent to user go to the next same thing what we did last time so as you will go to the next it will ask me what type of editor you need so we will again use start from the scratch so i will go to the next step as you will go to the next step again there will be an option called start from scratch use template so now you can use here a template which is totally from scratch simple thing as you can see here this is the thing which we will do again we will delete it and i say like hi special discount okay kind of that whatever you want then after you can go to the next step now on this next step you can choose to which list you want to send this email so all the lists whatever you have will be visible let's say i wanted to send this email to only this users because these are the blogging users instead i want to use this user which are the affiliate users so type of offer you can choose a list or you can send to everyone like okay i have started a new thing if every anybody is interested do and watch it this is my latest video kind of that so you can choose your list let's say in this case i will choose this thing then i can go and see here it will show you how many users will get that email so as of now i have only one user inside this list so only one user will get it as i will select this now i will be having a 9516 why 15 is here and one more lead here then you can go to the next as you will go to the next guys it will ask you when exactly you want to send this email so if you want then you can see here like this is your message basically this will be the subject line and this will goes from this particular email then as you will open it you should be able to see what type of messages you have typed then this is the area where you can see whether uh, your email will go to the spam box or not that kind of thing you can see here which list how many recipients will get it now after guys there are three options which you can choose here so number one is perfect timing as you will select perfect timing what happen is uh, get response no what what time your user is opening their uh, uh, mailbox oftenly so it will only send email to that specific time instead of sending every user instantly email it will send a at eight o'clock b at nine o'clock c at ten o'clock based on the data whatever the get response no it's artificial intelligence no when exactly the user are opening those email based on this it will send them email at perfect timing but if you don't want to send it at perfect timing you can schedule this email so basically what i can do is don't send this email right now send this email at this specific time uh and it will send at this specific zone specific time and then after this email will be scheduled but if you don't want to schedule it you can come here and simply hit it to the send instantly it will send them email so you will be having a three option at this moment i will be not using the send option so i hope guys you got a good idea how exactly you can use a get response kind of tool to set up your auto responder as well as your broadcast email and you also understood the difference in between both of this marketing tool you can use the get response this is among the best beginner recommended tool and you can also get a 30 days free trial the link is in the description if you want to know more about get response i have already created a detailed video in the past as well so thank you very much for watching this video and thanks a lot for being a part of this channel